Hi guys, welcome back to Sport Enjoyment. Big game today between Arsenal and Manchester United. In an important match for the title race and also European sport for Manchester United. We know they are hunting for it. So at the end of the game, we will give interview from the fans. They are on reactions, um, bands and so many more. Please, as you are watching our video, don't forget to like, share, subscribe to be able to reach more people. Most importantly, share this video to reach other people. Thank you. Yesterday, you go reach. You just believe say senior now, senior, junior now, junior. Cause I don't know why you go wear as now jersey today. You don't feel say they go beat you normally, and it happens say they beat you today. Uh, uh, it, it was an uh, expected result, uh, but if you look at it very well, <laughs> since uh, the last time they played Chelsea, I've already predicted that no team, neither Man U or uh, Chelsea, can actually right. stop us now. But the uh, take home today is that uh, the way Ten Hag set up his team today. I was actually have a bit of doubt because uh, the same back line he used uh, last yeah. game against Crystal Palace. Palace. Well, seeing them against Arsenal and they are able to keep 1-0 at first half and the way they actually played. Mm. If not that they uh, were actually wasteful or that unfortunate goal in the first half. I think uh, that Man U team today is capable of holding Arsenal to a draw. Mm. But unfortunately, Arsenal, uh, Arsenal were just too good for uh, such that Man U team to handle. But what I can just say about Teang is that he actually can play in this fashion. So why is he playing a rambo for us? <laughs> yes, like if you can actually play Arsenal like this and still uh, bring some positive uh, review from the match. I think what happened to the likes of Crystal Palace, Sheffield United, Everton, where team will dominate, uh, dominate us for a long period of, of time. He played brilliantly today. I love what I see, but... Like, uh, no Man U fan in his right senses, I'll put it that way, will be expecting that Arsenal will lose against Man U. Even I still have, I still have man. It's not about it's not about right free. If you see the momentum Arsenal has been uh, Arsenal have been playing eh, yeah. over time, and you see the consistency of Man U, you know that Kaki no be later. Eh? The difference is just there. And Arsenal actually so show the difference with that one zero go. So congratulations for Arsenal, despite the fact that they will not win the league. I'm still saying it again. They will not win the league. Are you sure we say they don't feel me? Uh, you see that match with Tottenham and uh, the top table now. With, forget uh, about top table. Now nah, this thing, then they call it Afonso. Now nah, Afonso, then still they do on top of the table. Mm. You see that match uh, between Man City and Tottenham where they won't play. Then they carry one record. Say uh, Man City never beat Tottenham at home. If Man City no score minimum of three goals for Tottenham, yeah, anything where you see talk. When you see my interview, yes, it, it's obvious. Now the same thing we talk today. The only, the only team that can actually stop uh, um, Man City uh, is themselves. Once they beat Tottenham, just carry the league for them. Forget about uh, final day or no final day. Their last game, that one who will stop them. Now like Popo will beat them. Do you understand like that? But Arsenal actually showed uh, the reason why they actually you can call them a top team. Because it's not actually easy. From the first game to the 37th game, I actually congratulate uh, Mikel, uh, Mikel Ateta. Yes, and the, po the, the, the signing of the season, you have to give it to Declan Rice. Mm -hmm. The guy is just too good. Mm -hmm. Yes, he, 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 yes, yes he, he pushed them a, a little bit further. And like I said in my former interview, that Arsenal are the most ready team. And they actually show it. But in a league where you have the like of Man City, no, no. Nah. Even Liverpool team. lost one game. In the whole season, I still don't win the league. So, <laughs> what, what, what do you expect? Um, well, with, with this review, with, uh, with what Tenang play today and going to next season, uh, me personally, me personally uh, I think there's still a lot of work to do for uh, Tenang. And from what I've been seeing in the media, I know Ineos will not sack Tenang now. Maybe probably he'll uh, finish his contract and he go. Because he still have to correct the wrong that he has done. Yes, we are unfortunate with injuries, so many blah 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 like that. But that is not an excuse. But the way he played today actually made me rethink that if they are get sense, eh, yeah, they play this week. we not suppose they suffer this way. No, now nah, even if we cannot win game, at least try and control game and make it more enjoyable. Yes, Arsenal actually scored one zero, but you can see that. Uh, uh, is it this same Manchester United that lost to uh, Crystal Palace? Like exactly. Actually, uh, play like this against um, uh, against uh, against, Arsenal. against Arsenal. There is no Rashford. There is no um, Bruno Fernandes. 
we don't have the likes of all our midfielders available. Yeah. You know, the pairing of 30, 30, 30 and above years old against Arsenal. No, now come on, you have to give it to him today just for uh, this game. I don't know, he might actually play rubbish against Newcastle. I know, trust him. That is it. But the way he set his team up uh, today, he was actually brilliant. And Arsenal, Arsenal, Ateta, don't try. Eh? I think until, what's it called, until Guardiola leave the uh, Premier League. Maybe that one we'll talk about uh, Ateta winning the league. But right now, you don't know. There is no hope at all. 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 Okay, now I'm more looking to that match than I tell you. Which player you feel say really impressed you today? Um, we'll talk about actually Ama Diallo. The, the gameplay where he plays today, you expect what he plays today? Um, Diallo the, 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 the the was not fantastic like that. If you look at it very well. Maybe in the first half? Uh, no, I, I think I will, I, I will actually uh, put it on the coach. The way he set up his team. Amrabat and four and uh, Kobe Maino and um, Kobe Maino and uh, McTominay jumping on their uh, two eight. So if you see the setup very well, there it actually worked. So I can't actually single uh, out um, Ahmad. Ganacho would have been the star uh, boy of the match because he lost a couple of chances. I don't know why you'll be cutting to your weak foot all the time. He wasted a lot of uh, a lot of uh, goals there. So if he had done something uh, this thing. Maybe probably, luckily, you scored a goal and this thing like that. So I just think we actually miss Bruno Fernandes because of his creativity. But who knows? Fernandes might be there and you might just be laughing maybe 4-0 or 5-0. So that's just the difference. You know, when you have a, uh, um, when, when, when you, you are short of personnel and, you know, we expect to play, uh, to play brilliantly. And I will say maybe Ateta was not expecting this kind of... Uh, this yeah, kind of setup. Set up, right. So it was actually different, like strange Manchester United. But uh, luckily, like I've always said, like I've always known, uh, congratulations for Arsenal. Mm -hmm. But nevertheless, although therefore, Arsenal will not win the league. But, but you win the chance. Yeah, no, 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 man, no, 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 You guys represent the winning team. <laughs> yeah, they are winning right now. Thanks for having me. Yes. Yeah.